hey guys so something rather strange happened yesterday uh, so this was the silencer that we recently got dented and painted and i spent close to 1700 rupees to fix it including plating and guess what happened yeah that's right that's a huge uh, split so basically as it turns out uh, the welding was not good enough so it kind of cracked from there <coughs> um, so it the funny part is it cracked without an impact looks like it might have impacted on this nut so that is why it cracked and this is my only uh, you know ladies carrier at home because they cannot come in the rxz um, and plus i also like riding this more than the rxz uh, so this has been down since yesterday so I'll, I'll show you how horrible it sounds So yeah, that's how it sounds. So I figured if it sounds that bad, then when life throws lemons at you, you make lemonade. So I thought, why not install this? I had a choice between this and if you see up there, there is a catalytic converter line. So I thought, um, I can at least try this once. So I'm going to install this proton chamber onto the RX100. Uh, so yeah, I'll put you guys on tripod and then let's do it. that is still very loud so probably what we'll do is uh, we'll put some uh, steel wool into that and see if that does the trick uh, so looks like it will mellow down a bit uh, in the meantime I'll take this beautiful silencer which is now broken into two pieces you can see exactly where it cracked so the job was good um, as you can see you cannot really you know make out and it was a very clean uh, belt but the problem was uh, i don't think there was good penetration because of which it split like this so i'll have to redo the entire thing hopefully he 
fixes it without charging money so anyways but I have to pay money for plating it again which is going to be a bummer because I was kind of happy that this thing was not plated and it was in factory plating but yeah life sucks so I'll put this in the car and whenever I go that way I'll probably get this thing taken care of apart from that I also wanted to fix this rubber bit so yeah I have a new one lying here so I'll install this here actually it's torn on this side as well but this side is not as bad as that side so it is kind of hardened so that needs to be fixed so yeah let me stuff some more glass full at the rear end and hopefully that resolves the sound issue so let me look for not glass wool actually steel wool so let me look for the steel wool that might be lying here somewhere and then we'll stuff it in and maybe that should reduce the overall sound of it okay so I'll take a video again after installing the now the bike is kind of silent it's leaking some of the exhaust from here otherwise here it is silent there is I've actually kind of stuffed a lot of uh, steel wool into it so this is not a permanent solution I just wanted to see how silent it can go so surely it can go a lot more silent so what we have to do next is we'll have to drill out those rivets and then uh, you know see how we can make it a bit more silent uh, but to be honest uh, now this bike is rideable which is which was the main agenda of doing what we did today so yeah it's pretty late now uh, I just thought it would be a quick fix but it took little longer than expected so let me park this in that vacant slot and then uh, that would be end of the day right thanks a lot for watching have a good day bye bye